Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl India and in today's video I just want to go over one main product. I went to Ulta today and I wanted to go there strictly for one item but you know how that is. But um, the item that I will be talking about today is the Murad, their Envito Environmental Shield City Skin H Defense Broad Spectrum SPF 50 with a PA rating of 4. That's like a long title. <laughs> So it's a protect, brighten, and correct formula. So I hope this lives up to that price point and the height, okay? So again, this is a mineral sunscreen, and this is the product right here. Yes, so let's get into these claims. This is a new level of skin protection. This revolutionary ultralight 100% mineral sunscreen with environmental protection technology shields skin from five main causes of damage that accelerate signs of aging and they are uva which is for aging uvb which is for burning pollution blue light from devices and infrared radiation um, it also states an advanced polymer matrix helps inhibit adhesion and penetration of environmental toxins while vitamin c helps brighten skin color correcting tint evens tone and boosts radiance and it tells you to shake well, apply liberally to face, neck, and chest. This product right here, guys. Are you ready for this price point? Let me let me take a break for this. Hold up. $58 to $68. I can't remember which one it is, but I think it's $58. I don't think it's $68. I could be wrong, but I'll put it up on the screen right here or right here to let you know what it is. But this is very pricey. This is the first sunscreen that I ever spent that much um, amount of money on. The most recent one was the Olay, which was $28. And that one was like the ultimate, but you know how it is, you always wanna try something next. Okay, and if I don't like it, I would return it back and get my coins, okay? Let me just go ahead and show you. After I show you this, I plan to take off this face and I'm going to wash my face and I'm going to apply this as if it was a new day. And then I'm going to end the video and rewash my face to take it off. So I'm doing this for y'all, my YouTube family, okay? Just for you. This is the little tube for $58 to $68. This is between that range. This little thing, oh yeah, I didn't tell you how much it comes with. 1.7 fluid ounces, guys. That is a little bit of product for a lot of buck. I'm hoping that it lives up to the claims and we'll see. Yeah, to try this on again, I'm gonna take my face off, <laughs> my makeup off my face. And then I'll be back and we'll jump right into it. Hey, okay, I am back. I've cleaned my face. And let me tell you, my skin feels so good. It feels so soft and supple. And this is how the applicator is. So I love that. Like, I like the little fluid. I'm squeezing. Not just a little line. I'm doing a lot. That's a lot of product. We're going to see how this works. So I'm going to start off by just applying this everywhere. Oh, it has no fragrance. Just like a... To me, it kind of smells like, it doesn't have a scent, but it has a scent. But it's like product, a product scent. I don't know if that makes sense, but whatever. I really don't feel a need to apply the sunscreen on my neck because it's nighttime, but I'm going to do it, you know, because you're supposed to apply it on your neck, so I'm going to just try to get as much as possible tonight, okay? So I'm going to apply this, and then I'm going to go and do another layer. And then I'll be back. Okay, guys. Oops, sorry about that. I am back. It has been... 15 minutes I had to go distract myself because I was so anxious to come back to you within that time But I was like, let me do some stuff. So this little baby right here for the price of what I'm gonna put it on the screen Whatever price this is the amount of money that I spent. I love this product. I love that um, The way it applies as you can see there's barely any white cast like you may see a slight something but Seriously guys, like if I turn this light off, when you use like a, a LED light or whatever type of light this is, it you can see it a bit more. So if I was to turn this off, like you can't see a thing. Like it looks that good. 
And I'm going to show you some photos that I took on my iPad while, you know, during the process of it um, seeping into my skin. But as you can see, it has a slight glow. Um, it's not too oily. It feels lightweight. Um, the only thing I would say that I would be concerned with, because being that it is very hydrating, now, I don't know how it would last. I don't know if this hydration will last for the two hours. And if it does last for two hours, when you reapply it, it might be a little bit more, you know, like too, too, it might be too much. So it just depends on, you know, but I can't really give out, you know, my thoughts on that until I actually do the ultimate test. But let's turn this light back on. Oh my gosh, this is really good. Oh, it's like, I don't know. I like this one a lot too. This is really good. Uh, this one was 1.7 ounces. It was $28 and this was 50 something dollars. And it's the same amount of product. That is a big jump, but this does have a um, has a lot more claims. Um, so if I'm on my phone, at least I'm being protected. The thing is, would you want to spend that amount of money? Excuse my nails. If you will want to spend that amount of money for the claims, and it depends on how much you apply it throughout the day. If you're, if you're someone that's really serious about applying it every two hours, then I don't know if this one will be for you. If you know, if you don't want to spend that much money. For me, I definitely, if it does what I want in the future, because I have to test it further, I definitely will continue to purchase this. Um, I don't think that this will be used up that quickly, honestly, um, because of the small applicator. I love the packaging. I think it's small enough to take with me on the go versus this one. Um, I, I went on a trip and I took this with me and I applied it on my kids and it did absolutely amazing on their skin, no reactions. This is a great sunscreen, so I don't know, but it's a little long than what I would want to put in my bag. So I feel like this one is a lot more compact to travel with. And I just love the little applicator. So you can get out a prestigious, prestigious, a, pre, um, a nice, precise amount, you know. Right here, I don't, I really don't think it's ideal for traveling. You know, right here, you would have to like pump it, you know, to see it. This right here is just a lot more fluid. What I'm trying to say is, if I'm gonna spend this amount of money, it needs to be a lot more convenient for me and for my uses. So you have to figure on that. For me, I definitely will purchase this again. So far, so far. So um, on a scale of one to 10, I'm going to rate this. Woo, let's see, it's like a 10, but. All right, so this is a photo. I don't know if the light is making it look. Yeah, so you see that? I know it's kind of look really bright. Yeah, the camera more brighter than what it should be, but so far, let me see if I can fix that for you so you can see. There we go. Okay, so you see that, right? That looks so good. And here's another photo, which is really, really low light. Another low light photo. This is, I look like a deer in the headlight right there. But that's another photo right there. Looks really good. So I'm just showing you how it looks in different lighting. This is a live photo. So, what is it? Is this live? Okay, so yeah, this is a live one. I'm gonna try to show you. Look, that looks really good to me. I don't know. Y'all let me know if y'all see something, but that's all the photos that I took. But um, thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you would purchase this product and um, like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video.